Putz, aquele carro ali eu não tem. Eu quero você. Cara, é lei no ar, é muito louco, exato, exatamente, mano. E é um bom jogo pra jogar aqui com esse lag que eu tenho, porque eu tenho um lag de quase um segundo aqui, tá ligado? Porque eu não tô usando a placa de captura certa. Eu tô jogando e assistindo direto no Streamlabs. Então investigar o veículo roubado. Eu não consigo nem sair. Exit. Ali. Direção errada. Uh. Ah! That's the car call. Just pulling out of the drive. Get him. Remember, we need him healthy enough to answer questions. Tá, então eu posso aniquilar ele. Suave. Bem de acho. Ah, quase que eu pego ele do lado. KGPL, suspect in custody. Show me your hands. Why did you run from us? You're under arrest. For what? Nice try. I'm talking about the car being stolen. You're out of your mind. I bought the car, and I've got the paperwork to prove it. Deixa eu ver, Igor. Deixa eu ver se você realmente tem o papel para provar. Hmm. Suspect. You purchased this car from Coombs Automotive Company? Yeah, that's right. And the ownership papers? From the same place. Deixa eu ver a cara desse safado. Não parece estar mentindo, parece estar confiante. Who did you deal with at Coombs Automotive? The owner, Richard Coombs. Good cop. And he made out the bill of sale personally? Do you have a criminal record, Mr. Harrison? No. Ah, come on, bad cops. You better give us something, Cliff, or we're gonna make this hard on you. I didn't steal the car. I ran because, because I've got some wacky backy in the glove compartment. We're going to get to the bottom of this, Harrison. Until we do, you're going downtown. Do you know who my father is? Ah, mano, meta fora não tá fraco. Três em três. É porque agora eu entendi, no início eu não entendi qual cara do jogo, agora eu já sei. Se o cara tá mentindo pra você, você é bad cop. Se o cara tá falando a verdade, você é good cop. É basicamente isso. E o outro ali, accusation, é quando você tem prova que a pessoa realmente é, aí depois tem que provar. Ideas? We need to get to Coombs Auto and check out Harrison's story. Vamos aí nessa loja, tio. Tá falando a verdade. Some of the most convincing people you will ever listen to are born liars. Você sabia, Orbit, que originalmente o GTA era pra ser um jogo que você era o policial? Só que era muito difícil ser o policial, porque em teoria você não podia atropelar as pessoas, não podia botar fogo nos carros. E aí os desenvolvedores perceberam que era mais divertido ser o bandido do que o policial, porque você podia ter liberdade de fazer essas coisas. E foi uma coisa muito louca na época, porque não tinha jogo que você era o bandido, né? Então foi uma coisa muito contraditória para eles na época. Vamos ver, vamos ver. Deixa eu analisar essa paradinha aqui. Hum. 
Uh-huh. North Fremont Avenue. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Harrison's purchase receipt was legit, at least. Okay. We have a couple of questions. All right, fellas. Shoot. Can you describe this Gene Archer? Brunette, maybe 25, 26. A little on the plump side, but not bone ugly. But a silver ledge. What was your impression of her? Uh, the tales of transaction. Can you tell us how you came to buy the car? Girl just wandered in right off the street. Pareceu verdade também, mas ele podia ter falado mais. Mas pareceu verdade. Nothing unusual about the car. Not really my usual type of vehicle. The price was certainly right, though. Do you know anything about the company that prints these pink slips? Nope. Should I? It isn't exactly my business. Deveria. Eu vou apertar aqui um... Um Y. Um, um bad cop. Errei. These pink slips are leading us to something big, Coons. It's time to stop being cute. I'm going to assume you're having a bad day, son. I sell cars, not paper. This was all above board. Yes, of course it was. Ele tá mentindo. Did this look legitimate to you, Coons? In my business, you don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Now don't come on all high and mighty with me if you want my help. Thanks for your help, Mr. Coons. We need to continue the investigation. Boys, about Três to sharp the phone call. It's built too low. Só foi ruim. Guy. Essa foi ruim. Please, you have a pleasant day, Mr. Coons. Pleasant day, pleasant day. Interview two. Crummy bastard. The paper is real enough, Belasco, but the car isn't yours. Hey, I got more to say. Yeah, the bum took a swipe at me. Put him down with my sap. Where were you taking the car, James? Blow it off, Greenhorn. You'll get nothing from me. You're a two-time loser. If you don't give me something, I'm gonna ask the DA for the maximum. My job is to drive the cars out of state. Does the name Gene Archer mean anything to you? Nope. Never heard of her. Uh, eu acredito se pai, hein? mas não sei. Era verdade. Well, my partner here convince you that you do know her. What happens to the cars once they cross over the state lines? I don't know. I just deliver them. Give me something, Velasco. Tem que ver as evidências, né? Where do you pick up the cars, Velasco? Warehouses. Mainly in East downtown. Come on, Velasco. You must have an address. You had a chance to cooperate, Velasco. Foi mal nessa, hein? Metaforando ia ficar decepcionado comigo. We have some questions for you, Mr. Lightball. Do the names Cliff Harrison and James Velasco mean anything to you? No, they do not. Puta, agora eu não sei se ele falou verdade ou não, hein? Harrison bought his car from Coombs. The pink slip looks good, and that points the finger here. Tá com medo. Mr. Lightball, we're currently working two auto theft cases. Why would I get mixed up in a thing like that? Tá we have mentindo. suspects with legitimate pink slips that were printed here, Lightball. Do you have a delivery ledger, Mr. Lightball? We would like to cross-check against the Coombs Automotive Emporium. It's a little out of the ordinary, detective. Uh, I'm not sure I can share those sorts of records. Hand it over, Lightball. You don't want us having bad thoughts about you, do you? Very well. But this really is irregular. Over here. Hmm. Hmm. Look for patterns, recurring names, unusual addresses, anything out of the ordinary. Maravilha. Achou? Chabarisca, chá, chabarusca. Cole 
Phelps, LAPD. All of you are coming downtown with me. Think so, huh? Let's jump at the cops. Throw out the guns. Ah, agora sim. He doesn't move until I've tossed it. Pink slips. Your light ball has been on a losing streak. I sometimes repair cars and put them back on the road. I need a pink slip to resell them. There's no problem there. There are at least four dead men in this warehouse. A couple more. Light ball. The guy who runs Marquee. He's the big shot. Light ball. The guy with no luck at the track. Tell me about him. One of the guys lying over there. You're right. He has no luck. That's the best lie you can come up with, Bigelow. I também acho que é esse delivery note. Gordon Lightball owns Marquee Printing. He has these big government contracts. The heat is off you. All right, it's correct, it's right. correct. To count your time in Quentin on one hand. Prendemos o rapaz. É meu amigo. Vai pra cadeia. Prendendo o carrinho roubado. Putz, aquele carro ali eu não tem. Eu quero você. Ai, carro, pare. Pare, carrinho. É esse mesmo carro aqui, não. É o mesmo que esse? É o mesmo que esse, eu acho. Ou não. Yeah, vehicle on locks. Marquee printing. You're under arrest. You again? I signed for all the orders and deliveries. Accuse. Save it, light ball. Ok. Ok. With the organization, we know about the death light ball. I agree, I have a small problem. Yeah, Gordon Lightball, I'm charging you with conspiracy. Correct. And fraud. Hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Beautiful. Damn fine work, Phelps. The printer's devil. Yes, vamos ver quanto que eu fiz de dano de carro. City damage. Só mil loleta? Que isso? Via com oito mil. Ok. Alright.